Hello, today I played while true colon else true while oh, shift. While true colon learn? Yes. While true colon learn. Close parentheses, open parentheses. It's are a coding you, game. Are you having a stroke? It's a coding game. It's like um, you did a bit of coding, right? I did, yeah. At college, I learned um, like C sharp. I love playing the coding games. Mm -hmm. And the, the Factorio e build a little machine game. Ah, you like having like a streamlined process that all comes in together and... And create something. Right. I played it for like three hours. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I feel like I've got. You've fairly... mastered it, obviously. <laughs> and it's weird. It's, it's like a story and, and short puzzles using gates. A lot of gates. Like oh, okay. Like so and or and if. You, you start off with like red cubes, blue cubes, and green cubes, and you have to put them into a hole that only accepts red cubes. So it's like, but you've only got a gate which says either red or else. Oh, I'm already like confused. Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I thought it was about teaching cars how to drive. Oh no! So there was, was there is like a self-driving car bit in it. Like, there's a cat. It's like, oh my god, Ben! Like, I spent so. Uh, I feel like I know less about this game than I did at the start of this basically, conversation. Basically, if you like coding games, <laughs> right, and the puzzle games, go yeah. for it. Do you have to learn how to code, or is it mainly puzzle? Well, it, it felt like it was going to kind of... A lot of coding games trick you into learning to code. Right. So they teach you, like, basic stuff, and then you're like, oh, suddenly, you're coding. Oh, oh you're look at you it. go! You're it's like the dad, your own. the dad pushing the kid on the bicycle, and he takes the hands off. Exactly. And That's then you plow into a tree, because it's hard. That's right. As soon as the, as soon as the stabilizers are taken off, I'm screwed. <laughs> I'm out. And, and honestly, Ben, like, I don't think I really liked it as a result. Like, uh, okay. I, I should have guessed from the name. Yeah, I mean, the name was gibberish in computer speak. <laughs> <Right. laughs> I feel I like feel that's like, a warning Maybe sign. that's like the barrier. If you can't, <laughs> if you don't understand what that name means, <laughs> don't play this game. But there are some fun puzzles. Yeah. But I found it very, very frustrating because, like, for example, it would be like, in order to get gold, mm. you have to do this with two things okay. and it has to be this amount of speed um, and I'm like I've only got three things to use and I've put them both in yeah. and it's still giving me a bronze medal on this and I'm like not fast enough yeah so there is this bit with a self-driving car right? okay and you're supposed to teach it yeah. how to drive not to kill people but sure the game is just bananas it's first of all you spend ages like doing all these gate puzzles and yeah. then suddenly you're doing this puzzle where you have to like control a car and it's like it's only got left and right on the motorway okay and then anyway I coded this whole thing I didn't really code it I just it's apparently learned off me you gave it and then I let it go yeah. and it just smashed into all the cars <laughs> and then said you get 100% score <laughs> And I was like, what are the fuck? You hit every car, well done. I, feel like I just feel like I'd rather actually learn how to code than any, any minutes spent in a game like that. I would feel like I could have spent these minutes learning a useful skill and it would be just as frustrating and annoying and boring. Well, look, whenever I finish playing these coding games, I'm always left feeling smart. Oh, okay. I'm left feeling like, maybe, but not, maybe I could be a programmer. Right. This one is the left opposite. me thinking like... Uh, there's problems. It just doesn't feel very good. Yeah. Then. Well, I feel like if you, yeah, the fact that you can't properly explain it is bad sign. Because oh, yeah. it sounds like you didn't understand. It. And I spent three hours. I did. I kept coming back to it. I was like, I'm going to give this another go. Right. Wow. I'm going to give this benefit of the doubt. But give, it a, give it a good go. I, a lot of other games I would have played less of, and I think I enjoyed more. So anyway, it's a no from me, dog. That's Avoid not from me. I don't want to play a coding game. Thanks. <laughs> See you tomorrow. <laughs> Goodbye. Yeah.